Here is what happened on the latest edition of Morning Glory. Um, if you've got a, a low libido, we're looking at it today, and a growing body of evidence is showing the importance of smell in libido and our ability to attract and be attracted to people. And last year, a study at the University of Gothenburg in Sweden, they found that men with anosmia, uh, no sense of smell, I think that's how you say it, anosmia, no sense of smell, they have significantly fewer sexual partners on average. And uh, the researchers said this could be because we subconsciously use smell to recognize others' emotional states. A lot of social signals are transported through the olfactory channel. <laughs> olfactory channel is your word of the day. And they are probably missing them, said lead author Iona Croy, a psychologist at the university. Smell is also important because of pheromones, scents given off by a partner's body through sweat. And uh, brain scan studies by the Karolinska Institute in Sweden show that the smell of testosterone and ostrogen uh, activates the hypothalamus. I think that's how you say it. Uh, the area of the brain responsible for mood, sexual behavior, and hormones. Uh, this may help to explain why 83% of women with allergies report their condition affects their sex life, according to a recent study in allergy and asthma proceedings. Now, one other thing that can affect your libido is TV in the bedroom. Couples who have a TV in the bedroom have sex half as often as those who don't, according to a 2006 study of 523 Italian couples. The study also found that what you watch can play a role in your sexual relationship. Violent films and reality TV were the biggest passion killers. Uh, I find Japanese porn works well for me. Uh, did I just say that out loud? And, and on the radio. Live on 96FM Morning Glory.